Welcome everyone. Today is the release of Kingdom of Intrigue or Kingdom of Conspiracy as the original translation would have said. That's right, the One Piece OP04 has officially released. And yet and yes, I have uh, just received my case, so can't wait to unbox with you guys. Yep, uh, yep, rather than opening two boxes, I'll be opening one box first. Yep, because it's really late at where I am now. Gonna open one with you guys and catch some sleep and also... I've gotten this uh, family deck. It has three decks in this box. Yeah, and I think that I will do this unboxing in a separate video or shorts. I am not sure. Well, let's jump right into unboxing this uh, OP04 Kingdom of Intrigue. Yeah, there are several things that's a little bit different for this uh, box. If you have already watched some of the unboxing videos or TikTok where they sell these boxes, you would have realized that there is no more bonds already and let's go straight to the cards. Yep, this is Cavendish. Yep, and uh, OP04, there is only six leaders. And two of which are ladies. Okay, the first SR is uh, Doflamingo. Which is quite uh, sought after SR in this set. Although it's a 10 cost character, because of its. Uh, oh, no. Crap. I got Kairos, I think. Kairos, the AA of my first box. Not sure if, if I'm uh, disappointed, but it's actually a very useful card in the uh, in this set. Let's sleeve this up first and top load it. It's actually a very useful card because. It's a uh, 3 cost 5k and you can just rest your uh, Rebecca leader to prevent it from getting KO or the uh, Colosseum The stage card Okay, might as well leave the uh, Mingo as well And the distribution rate for each box is the same as the previous one. There is a leader AA to look forward to, even the even the uh, the AA is out already, or there is an SP. And I believe there is a manga as well. Okay, there is the uh, alternate art done for this set. Yep, looking good for BB. There are a lot of interesting decks that can be found in this set if. following the release 
call the snakes. Closely. And there are actually all, a lot of fun cards that can be reused in the previous set. And one of which is the uh, film deck by uh, Do Flamingo Leader and OP04. It's really, really versatile. Yep. And I even think it is possible to become the meta this time around. But then again, Zoro is more or less the uh, main guy. Even if there is only one or two cards that can be used for his deck, it's still actually quite strong. So you can see Bandai has been releasing cards to cope with the Zoro deck. If you know what I mean, there are actually quite a lot of uh, cards this time to either rest or KO for the play. Low cost characters yeah, to prevent it from getting uh, too overpowered. Right. And one of them is uh, the Rebecca deck. where it has a lot of uh, potential to crash one cost or two cost or even bring down the original cost of the character to get it KO or even or even better uh, just hit the active characters of the opponent that's what the Colosseum does. Let me see if I can find it here. I should have one already. No. Okay, I'm wrong. And this is Kairos, the normal arts of this alternate art. Yeah, it looks quite good actually. Nope, this one here as well. It's the Colossian for the Sarah Who's who? Searcher for the Kingdom Pirates. Sabita here, Crocodile. drawn by Oda for the first anniversary of One Piece card game and my personal belief is that there will be an extra set it's much like Digimon if you play that card game where it's an extra set to uh, I wouldn't say fill up, but to give more options to the players or the collectors to, to buy them. Yeah, and just now, there is Sugar, one of the uh, one of the staple card in. The Dolphy deck. Dolphy as in the one in D 
this set. Right. Bartholomew, I have quite a bit of it. Yep, quite a lot of cards. That is very interesting for Croc Leader in OP01 and Kaido Leader from OP01. Yep, this. Let's wait for the AA of it. And this is the stage card that I'm talking about. Every character that, uh, as long as your leader has a Dressarosa uh, trait, your characters with Dressarosa uh, trait can attack the active characters the same time it is summoned. So it's like a rush, but it's conditional rush. Very cool, I would think. And the last SR for this box is uh, Yamato. Wonderful card. Very, very beautiful and well done. And yes, I will be uh, opening some boxes with my family. And like always, I will share the hits I've gotten from those boxes. And yep, this are what. Oh, this time round, let's do a quick review, shall we? The AA, Kairos. If you can see clearly, it's quite well drawn. Yamato. Very, very attractive. Sugar. Pell. OP for Dawn and the Flamingo. Yep. And if you liked my content, do help me subscribe to my channel and give a thumbs up to this uh, video. Yep, I'll see you soon. Bye.